Good morning, everyone, and thank you for coming. I'm Council Member Robert Cornegy, Chair of the Council's Committee on Housing and Buildings. We're here to hold a vote on a bill related to accessory signs, often referred to as awning signs, and associated violations. Proposed intro number 728B would establish a temporary program for the resolution of outstanding judgments resulting from accessory sign violations. It would establish a two-year moratorium on the issuance of additional accessory sign violations, as well as a temporary assistance program to facilitate the reinstallation of accessory signs for respondents who have already paid related penalties. The Department of Buildings and the Department of Finance would be required to notify the public of an existence of such programs, and DOB and the Department of City Planning would be required to develop an education program to educate, educate the business community about accessory signs and related regulations. This bill would establish an in, interagency task force to explore issues related to accessory signs and require DOB to provide a report to the Council that contains information about accessory sign violations. Finally, the bill would establish a waiver of all work without a permit penalties issued in relation to the hanging of an accessory sign from December 28, 2017, going forward. I'm joined today uh, by Councilmember Diaz, uh, Councilmember Richie Torres, Councilmember Carlina Rivera, Mark Jonai, Barry Gredenchik, and Fernando Cabrera. Uh, I'm, we can now, now ask the county clerk, I'm sorry, ask the clerk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> to call the roll. Sorry, Billy. William Martin, committee clerk. Roll call vote. Committee on Housing and Buildings. Introduction 728B. Chair Cornegie. I vote aye. Cabrera. Aye. Torres. I vote aye. Aye. Jonai. Aye. Rivera. My vote of six in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. Item has been adopted by the committee. Yeah, we're going to hold the, the whole roll open for Rosenthal. I just want to take a second to commend uh, my colleague, Rafael Espinal, on what is a great bill. Um, and it, this is kind of what the city should be doing to protect our small businesses when we have the opportunity. So in his absence, I want to let everyone know that I think it's a great bill. Thank you. Yes, and also my uh, council member Mark Jonai, who has been a strong advocate and who is absolutely killing uh, his responsibilities as the chair of small business. Proud of you. Uh, 